Horn works. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't we just kill this thing for the insurance money? We'll make it look like an accident. Oh, <laughs> uh, hello, Jake. Mr. Tanner. Hey, Alf. What brings you over, Jake Spear? And Raquel and Uncle Trevor are showing slides from their trip to Carl's Bad Cabins. All 400 of them. I've seen those 216 stalactites, 184 stalagmites. Those are the ones. Still having car trouble, huh? Yeah, but have no fear. It's being handled by Mr. No Good Wrench. Mind if I take a look? Be my guest. I got a hunch it's the distributor. Well, that rules out the distributor. No, here's your problem. It's the spark plug wire. I'll have it fixed in no time. Oh, thanks, Jake. Don't be embarrassed, Willie. Well, I'm not embarrassed. Not everybody can fix things. No, I'm not embarrassed. I'm sure there are several things you could do that Jake I'm can't. I'm not embarrassed. Okay, Mr. Tanner, start her up when I say now. Okay, now. Now are you embarrassed? <laughs> Jake, what can I say? Thank you. You never thank me when I humiliate you. You know, I can't be sure, but it looks like somebody cut that wire on purpose, then just patched it together real loose. Has anybody been under the hood lately? Don't look at me. I just honked the horn. <laughs> well, I have been taking the car to a new mechanic lately, but I don't... There's your this. problem. The guy's a crook. Oh, Alf, don't jump to conclusions like No, that. I saw it on 60 Minutes. These mechanics fix one thing, then they break something else, so you keep coming back. You know, Alf could be right, Mr. Tanner. I've heard of that scam, too, on that uh, David Horowitz show. Well, why don't I just give the garage a call? There must be a simple explanation for this broken wire. Yeah, you got took, conned, nicked, and clipped. You got your horn swoggled and your flim flammed. Hello, Sam. It's Willie Tanner here. Yes, it's nice to hear your voice again, too. Uh, listen, Sam, I wonder if you noticed anything unusual about my car, uh, <clears throat> engine-wise, I mean. Uh, like, say, uh, severed wire. Yo, crook! This is Mike Wallace! You're under arrest! Ow. No, I'm not accusing you, but it is possible. You know, not that I'm accusing you, mine, but, but you understand. That's not an accusation. If memory serves, Bob Newhart is much funnier doing his phone bit. <laughs> well, I guess we have nothing more to say to one another. You know, I'm beginning to think you may be right. I'm gonna call the Better Business Bureau. Have them throw the book at this guy. Preferably something by James Michener. 